All right, what's going on, laggers? Uh, this is going to be a quick video on obelisks, or uh, as Jedi likes to call them, he calls them OBs. I guess that's uh, that's a little better to uh, to kind of call them uh, something a little shorter than just saying obelisks all the time. Uh, I'm gonna check real quick. Uh, looks like I've still got a long time until this updates. This is use. This is my lab. So. Um, what I did is at first I didn't have it as advanced as it is I Upgraded it so that it it uh, updates every 30 minutes and I just buy uh, Whatever gears that show up there. I, I use I, sometimes I get lucky and I get some uh, three-star obelisks on there I gotta stop saying obelisks. Okay. I'm gonna try to call them OBs from now on. I apologize if I continue to call them what they uh, really are named in game Um Alright, so I am still building a OB, or just I'll just try to call them OB or gear, uh, a special gear for uh, for uh, Sharon Rogers. So uh, I have one that is interesting, this all defense one with the uh, damage proc and web resist. I'm interested in web resist because I use her for timeline. And with the recent update to the Spider-Verse characters, I kind of have a bad feeling that uh, that webbing is going to get a little bit popular again, um, just like it was when Silk came out. So I'm wanting to get some web resist and an invincible proc. Hopefully I get a uh, another, oh, another one of these little stats that's useful either like a defensive stat or a stun resist if if I can I mean that'd be great I, I kinda like stun resist as well uh, as you can see I've got all these gears I've built every single one of them it, it doesn't take me long between uh, the lab and uh, between the lab and the uh, special missions it doesn't take me that long to uh, to uh, build them and on top of that I use chaos tokens to buy them from the chaos chest so um, I'm getting them uh, I'm getting them pretty frequently now here uh, these three star gears these are garbage so I'm just gonna get rid of those uh, let's see so the first one gives me 75 so that gives me what 12 and this gives me okay so that's 100% you want to try to um, to use you know all your your percentage effectively so you don't want any uh, any gears to go to waste I apologize for my uh, notifications coming in um, so you don't want you know any percentages to go to waste so I usually just try to calculate and not mess up uh, while I'm adding in these uh, these uh, gears to uh, to upgrade the one that I'm upgrading so let's see each one of those gives me what three okay so one snare let's get rid of that let's get rid of crit damage another crit damage i don't want to get rid of those defense pen ones and i don't want to get rid of the uh recovery ones so uh there's just a theory among the community that death pen is quite useful i know jedi stated in another video that we are currently Trying to figure out how the damn thing works exactly, but uh, we don't have an actual mathematical equation to uh, determine how it works. We just know it, it, it helps you in some way. And I'm keeping those recovery ones because I'm a big fan of recovery, so I love getting heals. I'm also planning on uh, tattooing my Moon Knight at some point, so I'm going to need a recovery gear for him. Um, I'm also wanting to try out some Ignore Dodge, but that I guess I'll have to get back to that one in a little bit. But basically, that's that's what I do. I uh, I try to save whatever gears I'm currently going to aim for. And I upgrade them as much as I can. So looks like we're gonna have to do a stop here at 53%. That wasn't too bad. Uh, I started this uh, 
this four star gear yesterday so um, by the end of the day I should have it at uh, at grade six at six stars so it takes me about two anywhere between two to three days to uh, build them the way I do and I do have you know gold enough gold to uh, to burn out so that's why I'm purchasing obelisks damn that's why I'm purchasing OBs uh, that just sounds wrong that's all right I'm sorry Jed I'm just gonna call them gears that's why I'm buying these gears from the lab so um, if you guys are trying to build uh, your gears a little faster that's the route you can take you can uh, spend some to update your lab and then you can also buy them let's see here where are you villain siege you can buy them right here in the chaos shop so what I do is uh, since you get only 1500 chaos tokens every day from your three villain sieges is I do this uh, one day let's say you have 1500 you buy the 1000 one and that's gonna leave 500 for the next day and then the next day you get 15 again which brings you up to 2k and that's when you buy that 10 that chaos custom gear chest by 10 now some of you guys will argue that you'd rather go for bios that's fine I mean you can go for bios if you want if you don't want to spend on gear chests that's fine um, the problem is I have these three characters already maxed out so I'd rather go for gears at the moment um, I'm not interested in bios as much as I am on gears right now so that's why I'm purchasing um, the chaos chest which is allowing me to upgrade my gears pretty pretty quickly so I'm gonna have to uh, leave you guys to it and I will catch you guys on the next one this is uh, your boy lag checking out